Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Test Drive Unlimited PlayStation 2 Edition. Today is episode number 35. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button or click on the merch link in the description. It would mean the world to me. And also, don't forget to check in the description for our other social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. So make sure to follow us over on there. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Right, so we are on our way to the Executives Club. Uh, so these are for Roadster cars. And I'm going to be taking this, the Lamborghini Gallardo Roadster. So it's a bit like the um, coupe, but without the roof. <laughs> Pretty self-explanatory. Uh, what is this? Does it say what club this is? Okay, well, we've unlocked the club anyways, which is fairly close. I think that might be... I don't actually know what that could be, actually. Come on, cops. Get out of my way. I got places to be. Here we go, though. Right, squeeze in between here. Here's the club we're looking for. I get through. I got cops after me. What have I done? I've done nothing wrong. Right, here we go. Oh, I've just dropped my controller. Thank you. I've dropped everything. No, shut up. Cops don't tell me what to do. Right, so we are here at Honolulu Execs. These are for roadster cars. We've got things from the Saturn Sky to the Pagani Zonda. So, uh, pretty cool. Looking forward to driving against these. So let's go first of all with the Saturn Sky Roadster. Right, here we go. Let's go. Saturn. And we're off. Oh, the interior is very nice in these Gallardos. Ow, what is that? Ugh. I hate lorries. They're massive in this game. And an absolute nightmare to navigate around. Um, this car is also fairly decent um, to the point I think I can use it for the all-wheel drive club as well. Because I think it is four-wheel drive. Going this way. It's a little bit crazy looking at all of these um, overpasses. Uh, sometimes you do get a little bit confused where you're supposed to be going. We've got an airport over there, but as well as there being an airport there, there's also a racetrack there, which is pretty cool. I still need to find the uh, circle track, the round track. I don't know where it is, but it's somewhere towards the north. Awesome, look at that. Got that beat drop. Groovy tunes. Very nice. Right. The fact is, if every single one of these club races took two minutes, it would take me... Oh, shit. Not good. Uh, it would take me roughly 25, 30 minutes per video. But some of them have just been super short really gutted about this session because I was expecting these to take much longer to do but apparently not but yes we are absolutely destroying these clubs here nice very good very nice Perfect. And here's the finish line. Let's go and cross it. Ta-da. All right. 
3,500 credits. Thank you very much. I will take that. Right, next up is the AC289. This is the slightly less powerful AC car. Right, here we go. I do like the look of the AC. I prefer the uh, more powerful AC though because uh, it's sort of got a nicer look to it. How did that thing get a better start than us? Get out of my way. Thank you. Very good. Okay. Nice little drift through there. Nice. Okay, we got a sharp corner coming up. Nice. Here we go, here we go. Very good. It's only the second race as well. Feels like I should be much further ahead, but these have been a lot longer, these club races. I think as well, um, the Gallardo Roadster is much, much slower than the Gallardo Coupe. Like, ridiculously slower. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 Oh, not good. There we go, very nice. Going this way as well, apparently. We're at Honolulu Airport again. I really want one of these club races to be at that racetrack. That'd be so cool. Oh, this guy's name was Pigeon. Wow. What a name. I just won against a pigeon. Right. Next up is the Cadillac XLR V. This is quite a nice car, actually. It looks very fun. Very big, though. Very, like, big Chungus car. Here we go, loaded. Look at that thing. I still prefer my Gallardo, though. And we're off. Five miles for this one. Jesus. My cries have been heard by the uh, club gods. Nice. That was a good slide there. Oh, a little bit of rear contact there. In any other game, that would have been enough to spin your car out. Contact towards the rear is not a good start. Like that. But, ideally enough, it, it landed me in a good spot. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was a really good spot where it landed me. Oh, not good. Try not to uh, flip your car out. Go, go, go. Ah, uh, careful. Come on. Perfect. How many golf courses are actually in this game? Genuinely, this map is just filled with golf. Here you go. Here's some more golf to go with your golf. Would you like an extra dose of golf with that, sir? Yes, please. No, I'm joking. No more golf courses. 
<laughs> Got At Atari symbols everywhere. I was like, who made this game, I wonder? Next corner you drive around, Atari, Atari, Atari. Just everywhere. We're also very close to running out of uh, off-road penalties, so um, yes. Don't want to go off-road anymore. Else we get the DSQ hammer. Nice. Finished first place, two minutes 27. That's a very good time. Rip. Right, here we go. Let's have a look. Next up is the Spikers C8 Spider. I do like uh, Spikers quite a lot. They're very nice cars. Again, I've said this so many times. It's such a shame that that company went bust. Imagine if Spiker was still around now. They'd be like a lead competitor in cars. Because they are impressively nice looking cars. They seem even luxurious for nowadays cars. So I'm surprised they actually went bust. People just didn't like them. They were too st stuck up with Lamborghini and Ferrari and that. Turn left. I prefer weird cars. Weird one-off cars. Well, you know what we could have done? Could have taken the road down the other side. Would have been finished by now. Easily. At the next intersection, turn left. Turn left. Nice. Yeah, we would have easily crossed the finish line by now. Actually, maybe not, because there's no crossover area for this. Unless it becomes like normal tarmac road towards the end. No, it doesn't. So yeah, we would have had to gone this way anyways. We would have been in a lot of trouble if we tried to take the shortcut. Big, big trouble. But let's see. Come on, game. Doesn't take that long to load. Uh, so next up, we're going to see uh, exactly where... What we're going up against next. And that's a Dodge Viper SRT-10. So let's load in. And get started. The SRT-10 is a very big car. Um, and I think this is the one that... Right, let's do this. And we're off. At the next intersection, turn left. Turn left. Perfect. We're still ahead of the dodge. Just about, though. We've got to do... Um, I don't think we've done the D Club yet. Club D yet. We definitely need to do that. At the next intersection, turn and then there wasn't a Club A, but I think the Supercars Club was the Club A. It's turn just called left. Supercars Club instead. At the next intersection, turn right. But yeah, the only turn club right. that we actually did straight away was Club E. E, E, E. E, E, E. -E. That is like the world's best meme weird as well. Crazy. Oh shit, this is finish. I was less than a minute. Wow, okay. It was way too quick for my liking. Right. Final race against the Pagani. This is the one that I'm worried about. Um, every time I've said I'm worried about something, it normally is fine. But this one is A-class, and I know the Zonda's very fast. 
And the Gallardo isn't very strong for a B-class car. So, we could have ourselves a problem here. Hopefully not, though. Ah, uh, we need to have, like, roof down mechanics in Test Drive Solar Crown. If I can't put my roof down on, like, a spider car, I'm going to be sad. Very nice. Oh, we've gone wide. We've gone wide. Keep it. Keep it controlled. Keep it controlled. Banam, banam, bam, bam. Banam, banam, bananam. Banam, banam, bam, bam. Banam, bam, bam, banam. Banam, banam, bam, bam. Banam, 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 bam. Groovy tunes. Oh no! Get back on track, get back on track, get back on track. That Pagani's catching up big time. See if the traffic can hold him back. Nice, okay. Keep it safe, keep it steady. Okay, that was terrible. We've got we've got an angry Zonda. But he's down this section again, so this I know we were fairly quick on. So we were pretty fine. Nice. Right, I'm gonna stick it to the left wall for as long as possible. Okay, 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 okay. Nice. Where's the finish? We gotta beat this Sonda. Not have to deal with this again. Here we go. Across the finish line. Little slide to rub it in. Free car. Thank you. Result. That was very good. I don't think I actually need to, um... Fast travel to the next one. Because I'm just going to do the one that was right next to uh, the execs. And that way it won't take as long. Let's have a look. Okay, cool. We are now president. Your itinerary is being Very good. Right, let's have a look at the minimap. See where we need to go now. It's somewhere down here, wasn't it? Yes. Uh, oh, this is Club D. Uh, so we can instantly fast travel to there now. No need to drive. Because we've already unlocked it. Um, so we're going to see. What car are we going to drive? Oh, we've only got the Skyline. Oops. Okay. Let's drive the Skyline then. We're going to be taking the Skyline for the entire thing. Right. Here we go. Going up against a Mercedes AMG, first of all. And we're off. Awesome. Great start so far. Uh, the other car's pretty quick, surprisingly. Oh gosh, this is slow. We've been driving fast cars for so long. That was the worst drift ever. That wasn't even a drift, that was understeer. Right, we gotta go this way. Look at that. Just look at all those roads. There are roads after roads. That is just crazy. But here we go, across the line. Ta-da! Emma Stafford, defeated. Good. 
I mean, not good, but good. Ah. Uh. Very nice. Right, next up is the 350Z Coupe. Uh, we haven't got any of the Nismo 350s in here, which is good. I don't think any of the Nismos are actually D-Class. I think they instantly go up to C. Except maybe the S-Tune. The S-Tune might be okay. But definitely both of the Nismo R-Tunes are D-Class. And we're off. Two miles for this race. It seems short, but it takes a lot longer for this car to do that distance than the Lamborghini. Lamborghini, 50 seconds. This car, a minute 30. Right, we're going down this way now. Perfect. AI cars do a great job in this game, actually. They really do. Come on, slow down. Perfect. Ah, oh, this is going to make me go... Is this going underneath or above? It's going above them all. Meow. All right. And the finish line is just around one of these corners. Is it? Here we go, this one. One minute 10 for that. Very good, all right, I'll take that. And yeah, it, for some reason, the music has to finish playing, otherwise it does this glitch and it takes forever to load. It's a weird thing. It didn't happen on PSP. That definitely didn't happen on PSP. Um, but next up is the Cadillac XLR V. Let's go. Let's do this. Here we go. All right. A Jason is the other guy's name. Wow. Not very clever names once you start getting later on in the game. It's just like, oh yeah, we just use a random word generator at this point. They may as well have done that, actually. Come on, let's do this. Oh no, massive crash into the wall there. Come on, let's keep this going. Once we've done this, I don't have to do any more clubs until I finished the majority of the races and just left out the um, big championship at the end. Then we'll do the final six clubs and then the big races. The big races is going to be the final thing. And I think the big final race is going to be split up into two videos because of how long it will be. It will be way too long to fit into one normal video. But there we go. 1 minute 20. I've done it again. See? I keep forgetting. Stop forgetting. Stupid. Right. Uh, so that is the third car done. So we've got three more to do. Uh, Mercedes-Benz SLK, Audi TT Quattro, and the Skyline. So let's go against the Mercedes-Benz SLK 55 now. Awesome. Right, let's go. Ba -na -bum 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 -bum. Look at that Mercedes, though. And we're off. Coolio. Look at that though. It's still impressive. 
The amount of roads that they have rendered in this section here. I mean, I don't know if they're... Oh, no. I've overshot it. No. We're going to have to get back on the tarmac. Unbelievable. How have I done that? I was too busy looking at the road. Um, but I don't feel like they are rendering cars on the top while you're down here. I may be wrong. They might be. Um, but there's no actual way of checking in test drive without... Because there's no photo mode, I don't think. I haven't actually checked. There probably is a photo mode. Is there? No, there isn't. So... Goodbye, car. It's nice. All right. Oh, I saw that car coming. That was too close for comfort. Right, we can go on the correct side of the road now. And the Mercedes has crashed. You heard it in your ears. Come on. Come on. We've got this car and then two more and that's it. Then I can sleep. And then have to wake up and edit it. Rip. Me. Ah, I let go of the thumbstick. <laughs> Why did I do that? My thumb slipped off of the thumbstick, so I was worried that I was just going to go straight on and onto the off-road, where I would have then failed the race. Because I already have penalties, so... I wouldn't have been able to recover that if I had of Yeah. Big problem. Right, next up is the Audi TT Quattro Sport. Let's go. I've just seen the name of the president that we're going to have to go against in a bit, and uh, it's not funny. Right, here we go. Second to last car. Let's go. Uh, what on earth is the AI car done? Why on... Why has the AI car done a U-turn? Actually successfully managed to pull off that U-turn he did. And well enough that they are ahead of me now. I'm really surprised why the AI car done that though. And why he's now on the wrong side of the road. AI cars are stupid sometimes. Awesome. Very good, very good. Ah, careful. Got 2.2 miles left to go. Left turn, left turn, left. Left. Awesome. Wait, what? Why does it say second? Huh? Game. If I get to the finish and the car's already... Uh, already across that finish line, I'll be pissed. He's behind me. This game, man. <laughs> it's weird. Games love to glitch out on me and cause me to have a minor heart attack. Love doing it. There we go. We finished first. Awesome. Heart attack avoided. Come on. 
I'm knackered. I've been recording for four hours non-stop. Right, next up is the Skyline GTR R34. This is it. This is it. Ah, oh, Jesus. You can tell as you go through, like, recording sessions. You can see when I start getting tired. And I don't have my game of fuel yet. So, no. I can't drink that. You are in the wrong direction. Please turn around. Yeah, that, that definitely tricked me out. And uh, that guy's called Mad Skills, but he's managed to uh, do Mad Skills and get himself stuck. Why did it send us to do a U-turn? That is so weird. Like the last mission, it told us to go round. And the AI car did a U-turn. This time, the game told us to do a U-turn. It's very confusing. Okay. Well, we're on a roll now, so it doesn't matter. Come on. Turn left. Nice. Two miles left to go. Come on. We're nearly at the finish. We're nearly the proud owner of the D Club. Zero point three. Zero point two. Zero point one. Ta da! Oh, I didn't spin. Willie Mad Skills Jefferson. Wow, what a name. Not quite a million by the end of the session, but. I can't complain. <sighs> Jesus, I'm tired. But there we go. We are the president of Club D. Very nice. Very good. Very nice. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit that join button or click on the merch link in the description. It would mean the world to me. And also, don't forget to check in the description for our other social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. So make sure to follow us over on there. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.